Will gene editing change everything? Let's talk about CRISPR. Genetic modification is really cool. It's also confusing and maybe a little scary. And yet people are really excited about a process called CRISPR. CRISPR is an acronym and it stands for Clustered Regularly Interspaced Short Palindromic Repeat. It has to do with DNA, you know, that molecule that carries genetic information. Specifically, we're talking bacterial DNA. Bacteria are single-celled organisms, and like other organisms, they can sometimes be vulnerable to viruses. When a virus attacks bacteria, it injects its own genetic information into the cell, and then it takes over the molecular machinery so that it can replicate itself inside the bacterial cell until the cell explodes. Well, some bacteria have an immune system called CRISPR, which is essentially a collection of instructions on how to fight off viruses, as well as a record of every type of virus that that bacteria has ever encountered. When a virus invades a cell, proteins known as Cas9 spring into action. Now, these Cas9 proteins contain little sequences of RNA, which are a kind of viral mugshot. When the RNA in the Cas9 matches up with the DNA in the virus, the Cas9 cuts and destroys that viral DNA. Now here's where things get interesting. Let's say I want to target a trait like eye color. I could take one of these Cas9 proteins and encode it with an eye color RNA strand. My engineered protein would then go find the eye color sequence in the DNA and when it matches up, snip, cut it right out of the genetic code. When the cell attempts to repair the DNA break, I can sneak a new eye color gene sequence into the gap. Boom! I've just edited that organism's genetic code. Does this mean we're going to be able to clear up genetic diseases and disorders, or even give us the ability to do new things like maybe we live longer, or run faster, or lift heavier things? Let's slow down a bit. What CRISPR is allowing us to do is more effectively cut genes out of a sequence, and that has huge potential further down the line, but we have to walk before we can run. Now, maybe in the future, we'll be able to eradicate certain diseases or even boost human ability. For right now, we're just expanding our knowledge, which already has me excited. But I have a question for you guys. What recent scientific discovery or process has you excited? Because we might wanna do a show about it. Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this episode, make sure you hit like and subscribe to our channel to join the Forward Thinking Think Tank. Big thanks to Toyota for sponsoring our show and making it possible. And guys, if you like this, you're gonna love these other videos of how awesome our future is going to be.